Hello Mill Creek Bands, this is Mr. Dammond here. Uh, this video is for both the 7th and 8th graders and today I'm just going to show you a brief video on how to upload playing tests on the canvas. It's relatively easy and uh, hopefully this will be nice and clear for you. Um, again, as always, if you have questions, uh, feel free to reach out to me, send me an email, I can help you that way as well. Um, so the first thing that you need to do is you got to think about the device that you're going to record on. Uh, the easiest thing and probably one of the best recording is a phone. So uh, the, uh, they have an, uh, the recording app on the phone. Um, so I would recommend definitely using a phone or you can use a tablet or your computer or your Chromebook or anything like that as long as it has a microphone. Um, it is your choice if you want to do audio or video. Um, if you do audio only, you have to make sure that you say your first and last name so I know who it is. Um, and that would be helpful for me. Okay, so once you have your device and you uh, do your recording, what you're going to do is you're going to save that file. You can either save it to your Chromebook or your computer or your phone. Uh, you can upload it through Google Drive. Uh, you can email that file to yourself so that way it's on your computer for sure. And then I'm going to do a quick screen share here and show you how to get to that. So I'm going to pull up one of the courses here. This is seventh grade band. Okay. So what you're going to do, we already have our first playing test assignment up there. So you're going to go to assignments on your left hand side. And you're going to find your playing test. Here we have playing test 1.1. Again, this is for both seventh and eighth grade. Okay. You're going to have your information up here at the top, the due date, which is going to be this Sunday by midnight, worth 25 points. How you're going to submit it is either a website URL, media recording, or upload a, upload a file. And you're going to be allowed two attempts. So if the first time you, you, know, you make a mistake or you weren't happy with a recording or something like that, then you get another attempt to uh, upload it. So you want to make sure that it's mastered before you upload your uh, video or audio of your recording. Okay. And then it has the information right here, which you're going to be tested on. And then you have a rubric down here at the bottom and you can see what the criteria that I'm looking for in all areas. All right. So when you're on this page, you're going to see up here, it's going to say something different. It's going to say submit assignment. You're going to click on that. And then you're going to get this option right here in the middle. You can either do a file upload. So if I was to click choose a file, it would pull up anything from your computer that you can uh, upload. Website URL. So if you decide that maybe you want to record through YouTube um, or some website, you can submit the website URL. Um, you can, this is a really easy way to do it too. If you record through your phone and you want to upload it through Google Drive, then you can upload it through Google Drive right through here as well. Not too familiar with Dropbox and Disk Google. So um, those ones I'm not, I'm not too familiar with. And then this one right here, Media, which is really cool too. If I click on this one, I can actually just do my recording right through canvas. So that way I don't have to record on any of the other device. I could just record right here on canvas and then upload it through this, um, which I think is probably going to be the easiest way. Uh, just hitting that media button and do your recording that way. When you're done, you can put any comments if you want in there and then you're going to hit submit assignment and you are done. It should be that easy. Okay, so if you ever come across uh, a point in time where you're struggling or you need help, I would say come back to this video. It, uh, it should be able to help you. And again, if you need additional help, you can always reach out to me and I should be able to help you as well. Um, and hopefully that gives you some instruction on how to upload some videos. So uh, look forward to seeing you in class next time and have a great day.